A ruthless serial killer may soon meet his maker. As we've reported, Governor Ron DeSantis signed a death warrant for Bobby Joe Long. That's a man who preyed on Bay Area women. New tonight, one of the retired assistant state attorneys who prosecuted Long sat down exclusively with News Channel 8. Chip Osowski joins us now live from the Pinellas County Courthouse. Yes, and Alan Alway spent more than 15 years as a prosecutor with the Pinellas Pasco Judicial Circuit. One of the last cases that he prosecuted was the case against Bobby Joe Long. Long was one of the most notorious serial killers in the Tampa Bay area, responsible for nearly a dozen murders in Hillsborough and Pasco counties in the 1980s. This week, the governor signed a death warrant for the murder of Michelle Sims, who vanished after Long picked her up on Kennedy Boulevard in Tampa. Long later pleaded guilty to seven murders in Hillsborough County. The case always prosecuted involved the death of Virginia Johnson. Allweiss says Long was the definition of evil. His eyes would glaze over. He would start talking about it in normal conversational tones. And then you can see like a film coming over his eyes, like a devil, as he got into how, describing how he would do these things, like, you know, choke them out or cut their throat and all this business. And always says he feels for the victim's family members who've waited years for justice. He feels like cases like this should be fast-tracked. He also said that the day that Long dies will be, in his words, a happy one. Reporting live in Pinellas County, I'm Chip Osowski, News Channel 8.